Jabril Peppers. There's a lot of people that question how he's going to be used. I loved the way you used him in so many different positions all over the field last year. I watched a young Tyron Matthew come in to the NFL and how they used him in so many different ways. What do you think a team's going to get in him, and how would you as a head coach use him? Well, those conversations I think were being had three months ago, two months ago even, but uh, the, the pro coaches that I talk to and the, and the scouts that call and talk about Jabril, uh, they, they see it now. They've watched all the tape. They've combed through it this year, last year. They see how they're going to use him. And he's going to be a safety. He's going to be a safety that plays in the deep middle of the field. He's going to be a safety that plays uh, in the two deep. But they, can all, they also see how he can be a linebacker, how he can be a nickel corner, how he can be an in-the-box linebacker, how he can blitz, how he can tackle, how he can be used in the return game, both the kickoff and the punt return game. Uh, so it's not even a question anymore. And from the people that I've talked to and what they have said to me, I mean, they, they really get it. And they're, they're continuing to do their homework on you know, what kind of guy he is, what kind of, uh, what kind of player he is, what kind of practice player he is. And, and I can tell you what same thing that I tell them. I mean, I'm, I'm haven't been around another player that brings as much energy to a practice or a game as Jabril Peppers. Number one, the number one guy I've ever been around in terms of bringing enthusiasm and practice, uh, tempo, not only, not only himself, but lifting as many other people as you can think of around him um, on a daily basis, weekly basis, monthly basis, yearly basis. I've never seen anything like the guy in terms of uh, – the way he likes to practice, the way he wants to win at practice, the way he likes to compete, the the, the uh, satisfaction he derives from practice. So, I think they're they're really liking to hear that. And what they're uh, what they're telling me is he's gonna he's gonna go very high. Well, that's what you want from your best player. You want your highest paid best players to be your hardest workers on the practice field. I saw that when I was in New York with Darrell Rivas, and it it makes everybody else step up to that level. You know, that's exactly what you want. The Rich Eisen Show, weekdays at noon Eastern on Audience.